In this video, we're going to discuss quizzes. Here, I've clicked on the Quizzes tab. You can also access quizzes from the Assignments tab. Quizzes have a unique identifier by the rocket. Here, I can see the quiz name, when the quiz is available until, when it is due, how many points it is worth, and how many questions there are. Now, let's go in and explore the quiz. Once in the quiz, I'll see some similar information that I saw on an assignment. I see a due date, the number of points it's worth, the number of questions, and its availability. Sometimes there might be a time limit for how long you have access to the quiz. In this case, the time limit is 30 minutes. So once I press take the quiz, it means that a timer will go off and I'll have 30 minutes to complete it. Once 30 minutes has elapsed, the quiz will close down as to the number of questions that I've answered. So it's important to keep in mind if there's a time limit on any quiz that you take. Below this information are instructions, details on the quiz or exam, and those will be provided here. To enter into the quiz, press take the quiz. The quiz will get loaded and it will show when it is started. You'll see above that there was a brief message as to that you had 30 minutes. You can also see that the time is running and you will see how much time you have left over here in the right hand side. Since there's only one question for this quiz, you will see that question provided below. There may be multiple different kinds of questions that are provided in a quiz, but this one is a multiple choice question. They'll have the question text, the, the question number, and the number of points that each question is worth. All you need to do is select the answer, and you can then submit your quiz once you are done. Do not submit your quiz until you are completely satisfied with all your answers. Another important thing to note when completing your quiz is that once you've selected an answer, you will see that this question one has been checked. This means that you have answered this question. It does not indicate whether or not you have answered this question correctly or incorrectly. I can also see that now the grades have been released for the quiz. I'll go back to my grades and I'll see that I've received a score of zero out of one. I wanna know why I didn't get this question correct. And so I will press on the quiz name. Once pressing on the quiz name, I can see the results to the, qu the questions of the quiz. I can see that the correct answer was question number three and that I answered question number two. I can see the score at the bottom and any additional comments will be provided over here. If I wanted to provide a comment back to the teacher or the TA, I can submit a comment here. Additionally, sometimes answers to a quiz or exam may be kept hidden till a specific period of time. Sometimes they might be released immediately. That's all for now on quizzes.